Can we get restaurant quality smoked meat at home? I really believe we can. Let me show you how. Today we are reviewing the Sea Grill Pellet Grill. And if you are as crazy about meat as me, you have to keep watching. But if you are one of those that prefer bland flavors, this video is not for you. So if you are still here, let's check this grill together. The Sea Grill is one of the most affordable and easiest way to infuse flavor into food. And the only grill system that allows you to go from this to this and from this to this with the push of a button. And we are not stopping there. Anything you can roast, smoke, bake and braise can be done in this grill with minimal effort and knowledge. So yes, you can become the pin master you always wanted to be by just in the barbecue world, there are endless options, charcoal, wood, gas, and electric, but each of them have its own strength and weaknesses. However, the pellet grill is able to combine the strength of all without the downside. And with pellets made from real virgin hardwoods, this grill is able to deliver restaurant quality barbecue all day, every day. But why Z grill and not any other grill out there? This grill, like any other pellet grill, has a lot of props. You will cook with real wood fire, since it is 100% hardwood pellet, and you don't have any need to handle or store wood logs. It controls the temperature for you, so you don't have to worry about that and be happy. No flares or any type of temperature itches. Bare minimum maintenance and cleanup. And the main and most important thing to consider, the price, the Greens, the Washingtons, the Lincolns. Yes, you hear that right. Z Grill is considered one of the most affordable pellet grills in the market, based on size and features. And by the way, as long as you clean and maintain your grill, it will last you for a long, long time. Even though I never did those <coughs> clean and maintaining on my old faithful here, it lasts me for over five years. And within that time, I never had an issue at all. Now, let's check my new grill and see all the improvements they made compared to my old one. One of my biggest complaints with the old style is that there was no way to clean the hopper once you were done cooking. I mean, you can always shovel it up from the top, but that's not a simple task. In the new model, they included a trap door in the back of the hopper for a simple and easy clean up. Also, the new design comes with a different lid handle that makes it a lot easier and safer to open and close the door. In the old one, if you were not too careful, you can burn your wrist when opening the lid. The entire temperature controller has been changed and now it's a lot easier to see the temperature on the screen when compared to the old one. Also, this new controller includes two thermometers probe ports to connect your mid thermometers directly into the grill screen. Now, let's talk about this specific model, the 700D4E. This grill has a huge list of features, but let's focus on the ones I think are the most important. Stainless steel doors, same on the grill lid and the hopper. The grill comes with two meat probes, so you can start cooking right away. The cooking grates are porcelain coated for a non-stick durable surface. Double wall insulation construction for an excellent heat retention. Enclosed storage cabinet which allows you to store all your grilling gear within easy reach and away from the elements. A huge 20 pounds hopper able to store a full bag of pellets. A huge 697 square inches cooking surface and a nice second tier for maximum capacity. In this grill you can cook 29 burgers, 6 racks of ribs, and 5 chickens. What? Yes, I got that from the website. Really? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the size of the burgers are, you know? <laughs> now, let's get into the ninja's tips and tricks about the sea grill. And the one that's most important to me is... Wrap with aluminum foil the grease tray, so it is a lot easier to clean. This part here is the one in charge of collecting all the grease falling from your meat, and slice it down all the way to the bucket outside. And as you can imagine, this will get dirty real quick. And once the grease and fat cool off, it is almost impossible to remove. So a simple piece of aluminum foil can make your cleaning simple and easy. Clean your hopper after each cook. 
Leaving pellets in the hopper can lead to humidity concentration in the wood, and that can ruin your next cook. If you ever heard of the pellet grills not giving a lot of wood flavor to the meats, that's one of the reasons. With this grill, you can remove the pellets using the trap door in the back and store it in a dry place ready for your next cook. Know the hot spots on your grill. In this specific kind of grills, the heat comes from the bottom, rise to the top and exits on the right where the chimney is. This configuration can be very confusing, but based on experience, I can tell you that the left side of the grill is always hotter than the right side where the chimney is located. Based on that, you can decide better how to place the meats in your grill, always taking that fact into consideration. Well, guys, what do you think about all these things we have here? We smoke a chicken, we grill a steak, and we grill some sausages too. There we go. I mean, we were thinking about baking something so you guys can see how to bake, but we didn't really have anything to bake here. Next That's time. That's the only thing. But guys, this is the ridiculously smell. good. <sighs> and, and the problem with this is the convenience. You just drop it in there, that little grill there, Run for your life and it will do everything for you. You don't have to yes, worry about it. It is so simple. But let me ask you something. Is it me or what here? What? It took way less time, isn't it? Well, no, it takes, I think it's normal time. I don't think it's uh, less long? time. No, the, the chicken took about four hours. The steak took about, I'd say an hour. And the sausages about the okay. same time. It's not, you know, it doesn't cook quicker. Because the temperature and everything is exactly the same, we are not, this is not magic. It's just the temperature, cooking the things, but the convenience of it. You drop your stuff in there and you run for your life. That's it. And if you're cooking <laughs> at different temperatures like we are doing here, then you have to keep an eye on it a little bit because of the meat and the different kind of cooks you are doing, not because of the grill yep. or anything like that. I love the color here. My Listen, God. Yeah, let's, let's give uh, the steak let's a little it. try. I can't wait. Mm. Look at the smoke ring on the beef. It's amazing. It's real good, guys. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> oh, my God. Everything is delicious here. Everything is amazing. Everything is really good. I have to give it. Yes. I have to give it to it. Give it, give it. Delicious, brother. And Everything sisters. is perfect. Now, guys, let me tell you. These guys, the Sea Grill, have a Black Friday special going on where you can save even more money on those prices. So I'm leaving the link in the description. You can go and go check away. everything down there. If you like smoking and you don't have the time to become a pin master or something like that, with the push of a button, you That's can get restaurant answer. quality smoking meat. Yes, you can. And it's amazing. Now, let me ask you something. What? Did I make you hungry? Did we make you hungry? If we made you hungry, you have to hit us with the like. Lots of love to like. Let me know down there in the comments. What do you think about do all it, this cooking? It. What do you think about the grill? It is a good grill, guys, and a good price. Yes, it and is. And produce these kind of things. Mula, mula. So check it out. That's all for today. But remember that I love you. Mm, love you too. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one. Happy Thanksgiving. Can we put a, like a pig in there? Ah! The whole pig? <laughs>